Let's hopefully not die. Yes, thank God. Usually I die on that part uh, very randomly. Like, I'll just, like, fall down or something. Uh, if we go all the way up, I think this may give us something a little special. Nope. That doesn't give us nothing. Uh, that's just my mind thinking that because I haven't tried that before. So I would think that, you know, you get something for that. So, yeah, don't listen to what I'm saying right now. Uh, hopefully this gives us something. Okay, this gives us red orbs. Something I don't really care about, but hey, we'll take them because they're free red orbs. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and get this magic chest right here. Now, this area is going to be a little bit more important later on. Now, these guys, you want, you're want you not going to be able to kill them uh, just yet, so they're going to be shooting arrows at you, and you're not going to be able to avoid them, so don't worry about them just yet. Let's, uh, should we save? I don't know, what do you guys think? What do you guys think? Should we save now, or should we just like continue to go on in the game, and then end the video off somewhere, and then forget to save, and like have to deal with the crappery of going throughout this stuff over again? No, I think I am going to save, because what I just said sounds kind of... Kind of annoying, and I don't want to don't want to end up doing that ever again. So let's kill this last guy here, and kill these, and kill these, and do we have any more? Do we have any more chests that we have to kill? No, we do not. So yeah, let's go ahead and take. And thank you guys for letting me know to say yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about, but yeah, let's go ahead and go up here, uh, which is very obvious because that's the only place that traverses you uh, throughout. Well, not traverses you, but. Uh, What's the word here? Not traverse. It's, um, I don't know. I don't know. Whatever the word is for, like, um, going further along into something. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> I was going to say something, but, uh, yeah, that's that's not irrelevant right now. Or not relevant, I should say. Not irrelevant. Because irrelevant means, like, not important or something. I don't know. I don't know. A lot of you guys, uh, well, a lot of YouTube people are pretty smart people, I would say. Well, I don't know. Maybe people would uh, disagree with that. But usually when I watch videos and, like, if it's like a video that's like talking about a topic like, I don't know, video games, usually people that are like really smart will get into the conversation and just say things like, uh, oh, this study here said this, or this guy right here said that, and, you know, some kind of big words that I can't really talk, uh, you know, explain and whatnot. I, I, I don't know, I mean, I'm not, like, I'm not hating on that, but at the same time, I kind of wish I did have the ability to, like, I don't know, use very smart logic to like explain things sometimes because I don't know I've never really like and don't think that I'm like trying to like sneak hate uh, I don't know that's the word I just made up but don't think I'm like trying to like I don't even know what the word to use here is but don't think I'm trying to sneak hate on these guys uh, it's just me saying that hey I wish I could you know, be that smart uh, even though I'm not that smart even when it comes to video games I mean there's people that know how to uh, kind of get into the system and manipulate the game to their advantage, if that makes any sense. Uh, but I've never really been... The only game that I could say I do well, like do that well at, is probably uh, Zombies. Which, zombies, like, that's that's pretty much the only game that I can uh, pretty much, you know, manipulate and, you know, use to my advantage. So, yeah, that's pretty much uh, what I come to uh, do and... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to end this off. But let's just say, let's let's just continue to play the game and hopefully kick these guys' asses because they're being very, very annoying. And I was going to use the uh, Rage of the Gods, but it's probably not that good of a time to use it just yet. And I am not going to owe this guy just because I don't feel like doing it. Let's hold down. Uh, another move that I use with these guys, I, you hold down square, or not square, triangle. Hold down triangle and it'll launch them in the air if they're not blocking. Uh, Okay, I couldn't show it off because he died before I could do it. So he escaped my uh, tutorial uh, on quick death and whatnot. I don't, I don't even know how to explain that. But yeah, these things I have cracks in them. You can actually break them, which doesn't do anything. It just, I don't know, it's just something you can take your rage out on, I guess. I don't know why you'd be mad though, but. Yeah, let's break this right here, which gives me more stuff. And let's kill this asshole right here. And yeah, I'm not sure which way. No, let's go this way first. I'm pretty sure if we, huh? I'm not really sure which way I want to go first. Let's let's just go this way first. Let's just go this way first right here. Let's actually switch to the uh, Medusa's gaze and go ahead and speed this up just a little bit, just a little bit. You know, speed it up just because I don't feel like dealing with the longness of taking care of the taking care of the longness of all this because it takes a really long time to deal with so yeah as you can see there that's the move that i was trying to tell you guys to do you hold down triangle which i'm pretty sure i've already done before but i probably haven't no i didn't want to do that 
But we will do it just because I kind of lock myself into doing it. Hopefully not that much background noise stuff. Uh, okay, that guy's dead. Are there any more that we have to take out? I'm pretty sure there are. I'm pretty sure there's at least one more there. Okay. Thank you for proving me wrong, game. Thank you for proving me wrong. So yeah, jump jump down there and you will get a free... What did he win, Bobby? Uh, I don't know why he's Bobby, but yeah, just get another Gorgon's Eye. Which isn't all that special, but hey, if you like the Gorgon's Eyes, then go ahead and collect them and whatnot. So, let's jump over here. So yeah, this is where I wanted to go next. Let's uh, get this chest right here, which... I'm pretty sure this is going to be me being able to show this off. Uh, am I going to be able to show it off? Let's go this way and go back. Nope. Never mind. Uh, but some chests in the game, which I'm pretty sure I may have showed off. Um, hmm, I don't think... No, I didn't show it off, but I'll just go ahead and explain it now. You guys probably won't know what I'm talking about, but hey, you'll probably be able to see it later on in the game. Now, there are some areas in this game which will... Um, I think... Do we go... Do we go this way next? Yeah, let's, yeah, let's, uh, now we have to do some backtracking, but there's some areas in the game that, um, that you'll need magic to, uh, traverse throughout, and, um, basically what'll happen is if you, like, the game will give you as many times as you can to figure it out, like, basically, you'll waste all your magic trying to figure out some certain thing, but, uh, basically what the game will do is they'll keep respawning the same chest over and over so you can use that chest to, uh, do whatever magic thing you had to do, basically, that's, I don't know, hopefully I can show it off later on in the game, but right now I'm probably not doing that good at explaining it. But you'll probably figure it out later on in the game when you see me do it. So, yeah, let's, let's, oh my god, let's just go ahead and speed this up. This is taking way too long. Let's go ahead and do that. Kill this guy here. He should die really quick. And are there any more? Good. Good. There's not any more to take out. So, we are very, very close to death. Let's go ahead and do that right there so we can get hit by the annoyance of those freaking... Undead Legionnaires, or whatever their names are. I think that's what their names are. The Undead Legionnaires and whatnot. So, yeah, now this part right here, oh my god, I really am not that big a fan of this part because I usually. You know, let's just go ahead and uh, speed this up. Alright, that, that took a really long time to do, so yeah, I'm not sure if I played music in between all that, but if there was silence, I apologize about that because silence is very awkward and people really don't like silence and whatnot. So yeah, you're going to need this thing right here, but uh, what I was going to say earlier is this, this part is kind of annoying for me because I can't really remember all that well how to do it, but I know for an instance, uh, well first off, I want to go in here and... Spam R2 because that's what we have to do all the time. We have to freaking spam R2 to get everything. It's just, you can't, you can't get anything in life without spamming R2, which, uh, you know, creates lots of background noise. But hopefully, uh, the way I have my mic, hopefully it doesn't, uh, you know, implement all that much background noise. And wow, my mic is, I don't know, it seems like my mic moved a little bit. Maybe I moved it a little bit. I don't know, but usually my mic is like very, very close to my mouth just because that helps reduce, well, if you guys didn't know, that helps reduce uh, a little bit of the background noise, so, yeah, usually my mic is, uh, right there, uh, well, by me, and, okay, here we go. Thank God for that, I needed some help. Uh, I could have went for the magic, but, uh, yeah, magic wouldn't be all that useless to me if you're dead. If you're dead, you know, the magic isn't all that useful if whatever you guys know what I'm talking about but yeah let's go ahead and uh, open up this door right here and yeah let's go ahead and fight a trillion of these freaking guy things here so yeah this part this I, this isn't even the annoying part but yeah this can be considered annoying because I mean look look at this, this is, I don't want to be surrounded by guys that's gay <laughs> oh my god wow disregard what I just said but uh, yeah I don't know um, I don't know, I guess I can kind of redeem myself a little bit, but that's something that's been, you know, talked about for the long. It's just like, I don't know if you guys watch the news, but it's just something that's been going on for a while. It's like, you know, even though I probably shouldn't be talking about this in this video because this doesn't have anything to do with that topic, it's a gaming video. And usually when people game, they talk about their life experiences and freaking stuff about the game, but whatever, I just want to kind of... But, you know what, let's not talk about it. Let's just me apologize for me talking, saying, you know, that word, because that word is kind of, you know, uh, 
serious word. You can't just be throwing it around like that because you will upset some peoples and whatnot, even though, I don't know, when you're in school, uh, usually that word, if you, well, if you say it around teachers and whatnot, then they're going to be upset. But usually when you say it in school, it's not all that, um, not all that bad, I guess you could say. Uh, well, I don't know. It depends on what kind of school you go to. When I said it in school, it wasn't all that bad. Like, people didn't jump the gun to get the, uh, get offended and say, hey, you're a bad person because you said that word and whatnot. But whatever, uh, I'm just going to stop talking right now because, like I said, I don't want to make any kind of, um, what's the word here, uh, make kind of any, you know, bad badness, basically. So, yeah, um, hmm, I think, uh, let's, yeah, let's go ahead and, uh, what you want to do is, uh, now this right here, don't have this on this little platforming thing yet. Well, this thing right here that I'm walking in, t in front of, don't have this thing on this little platform right here just yet. You want What you want to do is go ahead and jump up here and collect this thing right here, which, you know, obviously you're going to need that to uh, do this. Now, this crank right here, uh, it is a broken lever at one time. It opened the door at the end of the room. Now it's useless. Yeah, it used to open up. Now that crank thing, the thingy there, you still open up this room right here, but it's obviously broken. But what you want to do is now that you've wrote, well, now that you've uh, pulled this lever once and it, you know, pulling it once pulls the stairs down. But basically, once you have it down once without it, without this being on that, uh, I'm probably not even explaining this right. But basically, go ahead and push it on here. Um, basically, you don't want to have it on there once you uh, pull the lever down once. And then once you have it on there, uh, go ahead and... I think I may have done this wrong already. Pull that thing back up. Uh, go ahead and pull this off again. Uh, just basically follow the steps that I'm doing and you should be able to do this just right. Go ahead and pull this down once again. And that's gonna pull the stairs down once again. And go ahead and pull this thing on here again. And hopefully I think this should be right. If it isn't, then I am kind of screw. Uh, yeah, it's right. So yeah, there you go. Uh, now, let's go ahead and show this off because I'm pretty sure I did. Uh, now this door right here, you can't, well, obviously you can't open it without something. It is a reinforced door. You feel a powerful yet benevolent presence radiating from the other side. Yeah, now you can't.